We've almost made it through the digestive tubing. <coughs> and the large intestine really isn't that memorable, except that usually somewhere in the epithelial tissue you have, um, depending on where you are in the large intestine, the closer to the out point, the more likely you are to find these. But um, embedded in the mucosa are jillions and jillions and jillions, I'm telling you, of goblet cells. I don't think we've identified goblet cells yet, which is a tragedy. Goblet cells are the coolest single-celled exocrine glands that you will ever find. They look like little vases, and they're filled with a substance called mucin. They're like filled with little mucin particles, and this is the lumen up here. And they barf out the mucin, and then the mucin combines with water in the lumen and turns into mucus plus water equals true love always mucus. Ha. So um, let's go take a look at the large intestine and its holy goblet cells, if I can find the thing I'm supposed to click on. All right, check it out. You might be like, dude, whatever. Where's my lumen? Well, this is actually my lumen. Doesn't this look epithelial? You're getting kind of a sense, aren't you? Say yes. So we're going to zoom in. If this is epithelial, like what? This looks really weird, doesn't it? What kind of tissue is this? Well, look really closely. This is a great example. This is easily simple columnar epithelium. But what are these big old blobs? Those are goblet cells. And, dude, if you don't think that's a lot of goblet cells, then, like, look, it even looks slippery and slidey and like a doo-doo's going to slip, slide its way out, which is the point of having them all there. <gasps> look how cool that is. Oh, my gosh. They look like they're barfing it out as we speak. Probably because they are. Oh, my gosh, I love goblet cells. Okay. So large intestine, look for those goblet cells. Do you think there are goblet cells in other places in the digestive tract? Totally. So it's kind of like you make a call, man. You look at all the clues and you decide, I think my best bet is large intestine because of the goblet cells. And then you, like, trust your awesome studying. Let's go check out our last digestive thing. It's not even a tube. <laughs>